Hey y'all, it's Costco time. I'm heading uh, to Costco for the month of May um, just to stock up on some meats. Recently I went to Sam's Club and I got a bunch of fruits and vegetables um, and now I need to stock up on some meats from Costco. It's early Monday morning. I'm praying that they're fully stocked. I need to get paper towels and everything. It's about 7.50. Even though Costco technically, technically doesn't open until 10, um, they've been opening early um, if you just, if you're there and you show up early, they'll open up early for you. So at least that's what hell was a month ago. So we'll see. Um, I also need to stop at the Dollar Tree. I don't know if I'll be able to, if they open at eight, I may stop there first and then go to Costco, but we'll see girl. I also need to go to Publix and I'm just trying to do too much in one day. So I may have to just go to Publix tomorrow. There's not too much I need on my list from Costco. Like I said, just meats and restocking on some of our normal things. And I'm going to be picking up some things for my parents and I'm gonna take you guys along. Of course, I'm equipped with the mask that my mom made, the mask cover that my mom made, a mask that goes on, and then of course my DIY face shield. Who could forget? All right, let's go. All right, so I'm at Costco, and I don't know if it's elderly hour or what, but there's nothing but elderly people waiting out there. It's 8.27, um, and I just don't know. I don't wanna be like, a jerk and, and bust in on the elderly hour when it's f strictly for the elders. I'm gonna walk up to the up to the door and read. I'm sure they have the signs there. I'm not sure. I don't. I didn't. I thought it was only Tuesdays and Thursdays, but I get confused because I could be confusing that with Target or Publix. They're not. Not every store is the same. So I'm gonna walk up there and see. Now, if it's only elderly hour from say like nine to ten, then I don't know. I'm just gonna have to sit here and wait because I don't want to go home and then come back. You know, or maybe I'll try to go to Publix while while I wait. But I'm trying to get in to get the good stuff, girl. Oh, look at this. Let me see. I'm just gonna have to walk up there and see. This is what it looks like right now. We have a. Um, sign up and tells you exactly what they have in stock and what they don't. They don't have Lysol in stock and they don't have disinfectant wipes in stock but they do have bleach and I'm going to get some of that and they do have toilet paper. I don't need any of that but still. And I don't have my face shield on. I hope you guys can hear me because it's just too hot. I can't do it to myself. I will pass out out here standing in the sun waiting to get in here so I, I don't know what time they're going to open the door so I'm just having to just do it like this. Look at this line, y'all. It is no joke. It goes down to the end of the building. So look at this. I'm under 60, so they're having me line right here. I guess it is elderly hour. But their sign is not right because it says if you're over 60, it's Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays. So I'm confused. But this is what they have in stock here. I hope you guys can hear me okay. And that this is what they don't have in stock. Huh. They are limiting your meats because it's telling you the meat shortage is coming. They're limiting the meat that you can get. You can only buy three packages in any combination per membership. I can't get in, y'all. I just have to stand here and wait. And I pray that they still have paper towels and some meat left. Later. I'm still waiting, y'all. It is 9:21. Um, and I still have. It should have let us in at around 9:45. I'm just gonna wait because I'm already here and it is what it is, you know. I don't want to go all the way back home. So I hope you can hear me. Look at how long the line is now, y'all. Over 60 and under. Eventually. I need it! Really. <laughs> I'm like running to the paper towels. <sighs> the paper towels are in the middle of the aisle now. I wish I could just shop around, y'all. I miss it so much. Um, but I'm going to grab some paper towels. They have a ton of Charmin toilet paper. I wish they had Kirkland brand toilet paper. I mean, I wish they had Kirkland brand paper towels. They just have bounty. It's getting really crowded in here. Super crowded, I gotta hurry up. I wanna get this for the girls so bad, not that hard. I know they would love it. I know they would. 
One way in, one way out for the milk and eggs. They have bleach. $13.99. My card already, y'all. I would love to film more, but I'm just trying to get in and out because it's it's getting pretty crowded. Look at how crowded it is. Oh, they don't have my bacon. They don't have my bacon. Oh no. This really sucks. I guess I'll have to. I don't know if I should just get this bacon. I heard this bacon is good. I can't remember. I think Jen. Jen Chapman told me that this bacon was good. Um, I'm gonna try it. I'm trusting you, Jen. If you're watching. I hope it's good. Gotta get my cherry gold. See how I'm, I'm pulling the thing open with the top. At the top instead of using the handles because, you know, gotta stay safe. Price of vinegar went up. <sighs> Have sweet corn back. Yay! I'm gonna get some. To stand on this spot. They unload your cart. Um, which is nice. <laughs> you don't have to unload the cart. But you do have to stand on this spot here. Yeah, police tell you and everything. There's no more line though to get in. But I got everything that I needed for me and my parents. Oh my gosh, y'all. I am like sweating so bad. I got a saw everything. I'm gonna wipe everything. I wish I would have taken my wipes in. I forgot. But I'm gonna wipe down my license, my phone, my camera. Everything's gonna get wiped. My keys. Uh, yeah. This was a job, baby. But we getting it. We're getting it. Oh, yeah. Hey, Mania. First of all, thank you to the first responders. Thank you for the people, nurses, doctors who have to wear these all day long because it is, it was rough. I've just had mine on for, let's see, since 8.30. So for three hours, I'm just now getting back. I dropped my glasses in the store. And at first I was gonna freak out and I was like, nope, I'm covered, in the, I'm covered in the blood of Jesus Christ. By his stripes, I am healed. So I just, it is what it is. I just Lysol down my glasses. I wiped them down with my Clorox wipes, not Lysol. I'm feeling a little bit dizzy because it was so hard to breathe in those masks it's it's tough especially when you have that this mask and then this cover on it um it is tough you know to say the least it's it's tough and let me tell you something else okay not to be too um, tmi you know i do brush my teeth every day but to smell your own breath to smell your own breath do you hear me i'm gonna go and just kiss my husband and apologize if my breath has been stanking because it was not cute it wasn't cute i will say that much it wasn't cute so my eyes are just feeling weird <sighs> it just feels weird i'm like hot Whew. let me just get this stuff to my mom i'm gonna show you what i got my mom's as i drop that stuff off and then i'll show you what i got when i get home i've got to wipe everything down get home homeschool girl all of that you know we're just in it to win it at this point oh i lucked up and found lysol at cvs they only let me buy two, so I bought one for my mom and one for us. And a whole thing of Germex. What? Okay, I'm at my mom's. I got her corn, we have one of tomatoes, but I took one of the six packs out. Corn on the cob, apples, some cod. We split a paper towel because they only let you buy one. And some napkins. I gave her a pack of that. Some cups and some antibacterial Dawn. Okay. I am in my garage back home. I wiped everything down with a Clorox wipe. So I'm going to go through everything that I got. First of all, before that, let me share with you the liquid gold that I found at CVS. Dude, they have this just sitting on the shelf at CVS. CVS restocks every two weeks. So you just have to ask the employees when they restock. They were still loading things off the truck. They load it off very slowly. They do not put everything on the truck. On the shelves there was only four cans of lysol and this one germex left so i just bought it i bought um they only allowed you to buy two lysols so i gave one to my mom and i kept this one and then i'll share with you guys what i got from the dollar tree after i share with you what i got from costco all right from costco we have paper towels you were only allowed to buy one and i split it with my mom so i gave her six and i kept six i wish they had the kirkland brand i really am not a fan of the bounty but it is what it is girl you gotta do what you gotta do I got some more canned corn, it's my favorite. I love this canned corn. I got some Lysol toilet bowl cleaner. I gave two, the box is open, I gave two to my mom and I kept two. Um, I have some applesauce pouches, ground beef. You were only allowed to buy three meats, as if you remember from uh, the earlier clips. 
three meats in any combination that, uh, that you want for beef or poultry. Um, but fish, you can buy as much as you want. You can buy as much fish and lamb as you want, but beef and poultry is limited. So I bought a, a pack of ground beef, organic ground beef, some chicken breast. I was gonna split this with my mom, but she ended up going to doing Instacart through Publix, so she got some chicken that way. Um, and then I got some Kerrygold butter, some corn on the cob. I got some organic chicken drumsticks. I would have gotten chick organic chicken breast, but they didn't have any, so I just got what I could. Um, but we'll probably grill those for Memorial Day. Some orange juice, milk, eggs, bagels. I have two of these. I'm not sure where the other one is, but two of these because they come two for $6.99. I'll just put one in the freezer. Some eggs, raspberries, strawberries, cod. Oh, here's the other bagel pack right there. Tor um, tortillas, a bag of apples, the bacon, mushrooms. Um, a cheese tray because my girls like to snack on cheese and so do I it's just a snack that we like I end up getting a whole box of Ritz crackers some organic yogurt pouches Ava loves those I got a pack of vanity pair napkins I gave it comes four in one big package I gave one package to my mom uh, some egos and some frosted flakes a huge bag of, of frosted flakes again if you recall i used to get my frosted flakes from aldi but we haven't really been to aldi in a month because all these stores sort of small and i'm i probably will go early like one morning just to go to just get some of the things that i typically get from aldi but honestly it's just easier for me to go to costco because i could get so much stuff and then I'm not going to back to Costco for another month. So um, we're just doing what we can. In between for fruits and stuff, my mom does a lot of Instacart and she'll pick, get stuff for me and we'll freeze some fruit and stuff like that. But um, in the meantime, we're just making it work, girl. I do miss going to Aldi though. Those Aldi finds, no joke. I also got some antibacterial Dawn and they had bleach. Now I don't clean with bleach, but I got this bleach. Well, actually I do. I mop my floors, my bathroom floors with bleach and my um, shower with bleach. I have cleaning bleach, but my husband uses bleach on his clothes But I also got this in case I needed to make my own Clorox wipes I can make my own wipes with this bleach and it's a disinfectant It's been hard to find but I'm just glad I got this this will last us for years and years and years and years So um, we got that I also got watermelon um, I showed you the tomatoes that I got from my mom's and then I just took six uh, a pack of a uh, six out from uh, for us and then some heavy whipping cream now I'm gonna share with you what I got from the Dollar Tree in a minute. Let me just share how much I spent at Costco. Now, I had my um, executive membership award um, awards with me, not awards, <laughs> rewards with me. And so, grand total of everything that I got, it came to $379.51, which isn't bad. I thought for sure I was gonna easily spend $500. Um, but no, it came to three, three, excuse me, $390.91 with tax. Um, but then I had my executive rebate, which was 128.05, which brought my total down to 262.86. So I'm happy. You know that's pretty good. I just spent around $200 for uh, Sam's Club the other day, but that's it. We're not buying any more food for the rest of the month. Probably not until June. Going into mid June, we should be set. We should be good to go. Um, so okay, we're gonna start putting some of this stuff away, and then I'll show you guys what I got from. The Dollar Tree. Actually, I'm gonna save that and make that a separate video because I have an awesome hack to share with you guys to make your own DIY lifestyle spray. So be on the lookout for that. So that's it, my friends. Thank you guys so much for coming along with me to Costco. I know it's not our normal kind of Costco shop with me, and I know we'll be back to that soon where we can just browse the aisles together and just chit chat together. Um, but before I go, babe, I want to tell you this. Um, <laughs> I want to tell you this. Listen, I. <laughs> I've been smelling my own breath mm. for five hours now. Oh, and if my breath has been smelling the way that I sm I've been smelling it right now, I'm you sorry. Need to apologize. I apologize. Need to apologize. <laughs> I, apologize. I feel like a first responder. You just Stop it. I'm on the front line of that savage attack. Babe, that's not okay. I'm, I brush my teeth. Y'all don't listen to him, okay? Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. If you haven't hit that subscribe button yet, you can tap my picture up above. And you can also check out my previous video right over here in all of my social media platforms. I'll list it down below. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.